Hi, hello, hi. So my cat is asleep on my lap, and I thought I would make this video of my cat sleeping on my lap. There's not much else to it. Enjoy. Look at this good boy getting a heckin' good scritch. Heck yeah. Do you know who's handsome? It's you. You're handsome. As soon as I stop petting him just to adjust the camera, he smacks his tail real angry on the couch. See? <laughs> what a good boy. What a handsome lamb. You're so handsome. He likes little chin scritches. And he likes smashing his little head up against my body, if you couldn't tell. Sometimes it's hard to tell because he has these big ears, but his head is actually so flat. You could like, you could put a coffee cup on it. You could like land an airplane on his head. You have a flat head, oh good yawn. Does anyone else ever give their pets little massages? Like, I like to give my cat little head massages like this. And he seems to enjoy it, as you could tell. <laughs> Why do you look so weird? Why can't you just look at the camera? Oh, there, see? Ooh, so handsome, the lamb. Ooh, he's so handsome. Who's that boy? Do you ever just look at your pets sometimes and just, like, I don't know. Like, how how did I get so lucky, right? Like, how... How is this magnificent creature living in my house, you know? Like, does everyone feel this way about their pets, or is my pet just, like, extra great? And, like, imagine if we weren't used to domesticated animals, right? Like, imagine if domesticated animals weren't a thing, and you just, like, I don't know, walk into your bathroom, and there's a raccoon sitting in there. And, like, the raccoon's not being mean or anything, just, like, chilling, just, like, being super sweet. Like, would you be scared, or would you be excited? I don't know. Sometimes I think it's weird that it's so normal that we have domesticated animals, that it's like, if a raccoon gets into the house, we're like, oh man, a raccoon, wow, that's wild. But like, if I told someone my cat got into the house, they're gonna be like, yeah, so what, it's a cat, who cares? But like, I don't know. You used to be a tiger or a lion or something. You evolved from something big and scary. How did you get so little? How did you go from a big lion to a little lamb. He's making like the strangest faces, but I promise he's usually very photogenic. <laughs> oh, he's noticed you. Lamb, who are they? How did all these people get into our house? Oh, you're leaving? All right, cool. Oh, thank you for putting your whole tail in my mouth. You're just gonna, just gonna show everyone your butt. That's what's happening. All right, <laughs> sick. Thank you for that. He's just making himself comfy with the hole he's already made in this sofa that you could never see. Yeah, just. Go to town, Kylum. Make yourself at home. Yeah, it's fine. It's okay. It's not like it's a piece of furniture or anything. Did you see my cool shirt? It says, creeping it real. How long are you gonna do this for? Doesn't it look like he's making, like, bread or something? Like he's making dough? Yeah, that's fine. Just destroy that couch. It's yours now anyway. <laughs> oh, okay, goodbye. Oh, pfft. thank you. That's it for today's lamb ASMR. Um, I hope this was something. <laughs> Let me know if you want more videos with my cat, and if so, if you want me to maybe stop talking next time. I could work on that. Alright, cool. Take care. Bye.